going on guys? Happy Crumble Cookie Monday. I am back from Iceland and I have some news for you. One, I poked out my eye this morning, so please don't mind that. Two, <laughs> I'm engaged. Please turn down your volume because I'm way too excited about everything. But yes, I'm engaged. I got engaged on my trip to Iceland. Um, oh, my eye is so unwell. Um, Okay, so anyways, um, yes, so this happened. Um, I'm posting it on social media tomorrow. I'm just waiting to tell Joe um, on a podcast episode before I post it online. Um, I wanted to catch his reaction in uh, live time. So I have not posted anything yet, but when I do, please head over to my Instagram and show me some love over there and act surprised, please. Like as if you don't know already, I just wanted to tell you guys first because I just love and adore the YouTubes and the YouTube family and you guys mean so much to me. So um, we'll get into our cookies for now. So we have chocolate peanut butter chip, molten lava, the cookie dough, and this is a chocolate pistachio pie, which I think I'm most excited for this one. Not because I'm like, oh, I'm going to absolutely love it, but it's because it's so interesting and so different from what I feel like they normally do. Um, oh, I have the hiccup. Sorry. So we'll start, I'm going to just show you this one because I think the molten lava might cave in on me. This is so pretty. The cookie dough is a chilled one. They also had a cake batter, but like, guys, I can't get five cookies every week and I, or like six cookies every week. I would be so much more broke and I got to stay for a wedding. So that's not working out oh, as expected. Oh, this is okay. Ta-da. Molten lava. She's crumbling already, and I knew that would happen. Oh, the chocolate pistachio is also a chilled cookie, but that green color is like beautiful. Okay, let's start with the cookie dough because I always keep the chocolate ones for last. I watched Joseph's video of Crumble Cookie Monday. I am pleasantly surprised. Oh, I just dropped cookie dough pieces. I'm pleasantly surprised. I did not think that he would like the cookies that he, do he did slash rank them the way that he did. I'm very proud of him. He's really stepping out of his comfort zone. I'm going to go in for this cookie dough bite right there because she looks like she's calling my name. Mm. Oh. Mm. That literally tastes like cookie dough ice cream. Mm, 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 mm. That's good. That's really good. We'll do the chocolate peanut butter chip next. Look at how the ring looks when I crack open the cookies. Doesn't it look so pretty? So we'll talk about how it happened. Uh, I was in Iceland, obviously. I had no idea, not even the slightest clue. And when we were going in through an ice cave is when it happened. It was like in a glacier in Iceland. Um, I actually wasn't wearing makeup that day and my friends all knew. So they tried to get me to wear makeup and I ended up wearing it by calling me and asking me to borrow some setting spray, which is just a, a makeup thing for those of you who don't know. And um, when I FaceTimed her, I, she had asked for it and she was like, oh, you're not like, I was like, oh, you're wearing makeup? And she said, yeah, I just don't want to look dead in the pictures. I obviously didn't put two and two together. There were some other subtle hints that had dropped the whole time, but I would have never picked up on it because my friends are just so caring and so loving and so amazing that they would look out for me and how I looked or whatever anyways. Um, one of my friends asked Nick, hey, like, are you nervous for this excursion? And I thought, cause we were going in a glacier, like it's a little spooky, a little dangerous, you know? So I thought that that would be the reason why they asked that. No, it was because he was proposing. I had no idea, of course. Oh, Joe would love that cookie. It's a standard crunchy on the outside, soft on the inside, chocolate cookie. But the peanut butter chips, he just loves everything peanut butter. He would love that. I've had the molten lava before too. I know I love this. It's just like gooey and it tastes like a true molten lava. Oop. There you go. It's not the most beautiful break, but it is what it is. Okay, I think I can do it like this. I love that cookie. No matter how many times I try it, I just love it so much. It's so good. 
I definitely like this one because there's two chocolate cookies this week, obviously. Um, or three technically, we count the pistachio and the semi chocolate, but we're not con we're, we're not counting all that. We're talking about like pure chocolate. I would rather have this one over the peanut butter chip because it's so moist and gooey, and you can see that there's like molten chocolate in it. It's just so good. Um. So yeah, and then we got to this waterfall part within the glacier, and. He, we were taking pictures <clears throat> and he looked like he was about to walk away and I was like they're still taking pictures of us and he was like oh they are and he went down on a knee but like it looked like he was about to fix his shoes and then he started saying proposal stuff and then I like blacked out I looked at my friends all of them were like this with their phones and so I knew at that point that he was proposing and then I started to Kim Kardashian ugly cry it was great it was fantastic. Pistachio. It was in a beautiful country with some of my best friends. Overall, oh, this one's messy. Um, it was a beautiful experience and he did great. And I love my ring. It's turned, but there you go. I love it. Um, okay. I do this thing when I go out. It's called a pistachio ice cream shot. It's equal parts Frangelico, Blue Carousel, and Bailey's, I believe it is. Frangelico. Yes, I think those three. Frangelico, Bailey's, Blue Carousel. Yes, I believe it's equal parts of all three. This top piece is so good. It tastes just like my pistachio ice cream shot, which I don't really like love pistachio ice cream, but I love that shot. And this tastes just like it. And the chocolate actually helps balance it. This is a phenomenal cookie. I don't know. Mom doesn't really like chocolate, but I actually think she'll really enjoy that cookie. All right. <laughs> Time to rank. Okay. Um, what am I going to do as number one? Number one, molten lava. Number two, the chocolate pe uh, pistachio. Three, cookie dough. Four, chocolate peanut butter chip. And that is what it is. I want to know what your favorites are. Everything's very heavily like chocolate based today, or this week rather. The only thing that's not is the cake batter. But like, like I said, guys, I cannot afford to be getting more than just the four cookies. I'll be broke before I even know it. So. And it's only because I do it every single week. Like, I do these videos every week. If I just did it as, like, a sweet treat every once in a while, we would be fine. But I do these every single week. So, anyways, I have chocolate all over my hands. Um, also, when I was in Iceland, one of my best friends and I got matching little... I got pistachio cream on it, I think. Alright. I got, um... I, I do. This molten lava ring. And they painted it, and it was brown. There was, excuse me, an orange one, pink, yellow, some other random colors, cream. But they kind of look like cheese because of all the holes. So we thought the brown one was the prettiest. Um, she got me this fiance sweatshirt, and it's really cute. And my friends surprised me with a little engagement type celebration once I got back. And it was just really sweet and really cute. And um, I had the best time. Um, I'm gonna do a video I think of the top things to do when you're in Iceland because I think um, I learned so much from my trip and I heavily prepared to pack what I needed and I'm glad I did the way I did and there were some things that I learned that I wish I knew beforehand so I'm gonna do an all-encompassing video I think that would be really helpful for anyone who's going to Iceland I would say between like September October November and even into December um, maybe like the fall slash winter season but um i love you guys so much like comment share subscribe a new episode of hate that for me just dropped so make sure you head over there and if you want to see the reaction video to joe reacting to me getting engaged make sure you head over to hate that for me not next week is it next week not next week but i think the week after it's going to be the I think the Halloween episode or the one after it. We'll figure it out. He's trying to get me to like do a Halloween episode, but I'm like, I want to talk about the trip because I want to obviously tell him. So we'll see how that goes. Like, comment, share, subscribe. Make sure you head over to Instagram. I'm going to post my engagement pictures over there of like when it first happened. And I love you and I'll see you guys so soon. Bye.